I had asked a few times, you know, to my dentist, um, what can I do? And I wasn't getting a real satisfactory answer. What I realized is that my teeth were patchwork and I wasn't getting that sense of fulfillment from my smiles and I especially noticed it in photographs. Actually, what really motiva motivated me to, to come in and ask these questions about fixing my teeth um, was looking at some vacation pictures from a year or two ago and finally said, no, this, this is not good. I feel good on the outlook, you know, but the pictures were coming back and I had, you know, the shadows and the and little distortion in the smile and I didn't like it. So I um, did a little research and I went on the internet and I looked for recommendations and referrals and reviews and called Dr. Chen's office and was greeted immediately with an, an open interest and a wonderful staff. I have to say the people here have been wonderful. Um, but I had questions. What can you do and how can you fix it and what will it look like when I'm done? So I could see actually see what my mouth was going to look like before we even started anything. And uh, at some point, you know, when we start getting in there and making the adjustments, uh, there is a point of no return. And I, and I understood that too. It's not that I could, oops, change my mind. Um, there's a point at which you can't go back, which is perfectly fine. All I do is look at the before and the afters and I know why I won't go back. I'm, I'm very happy. I'm very happy. Um, I'm looking forward to, um, you know, we've got Christmas pictures coming up and family and already um, just holding my granddaughter and having a picture taken at Christmas tree lighting a week ago. And it's like, oh, that's my new smile. Everything's lightening up now. So it was fun. It's, it's great fun. I look forward to it. I'm ready for a new vacation so I can take my yeah. vacation pictures. <laughs> you know, this, this aging thing doesn't have to destroy us. I mean, we can, we can go along and we have these little, little things that we can do to help ourselves. I mean, Ms. Clarell and I have been, you know, friends for a long time. So, uh, you know, brighten the smile and get a new haircut and live life. I'm going to miss you. I don't get to come back for a while. <laughs>